Hello, my name is Daniel from DDCL. I'm going to show you um, two quick little videos here about different stores and uh, faucets and fixtures and shower heads which they offer. And the second reason is if a owner purchases the products, they're responsible for the warranty. Therefore, if anything happens in the future, they're responsible for having it replaced. But if the subcontractor purchases the supplies, the subcontractor is responsible for the warranty. And if something happens, they'll have to come back and replace the item for you or repair it, whatever may deem necessary. So here we are. We're going to go to the first video here where we're showing shower heads and there are different sizes and you even have some great big ones where they just drain water onto your head sort of thing and the next little part here we're gonna start showing um, the um, faucets for the sinks and these come in various colors from chrome to um, black to nickel plated in this particular uh, system they're showing the shower heads on top the faucets below and some of them even have dispensers with them that's why it's so important for the client to understand and to know how much are they willing to spend on these items but I, I must point out that any of these prices that are listed here can be changed by the store. They could go on sale, they could go out of um, production, or the prices can go up. We just never know. So by viewing these, you have a better idea where you might want to be sitting. You might say you want to $50 faucet, but the faucet you're looking at right now costs $300. And as you can see, one right here, there's um, a gold color, then there's some black. Now we're getting into the chrome, then the nickel coated. So there's all kinds of different price ranges here. You can spend way over $1,000 just on a faucet. And this is totally up to the client. We don't choose for them. We allow them to choose what they want. If we're required to purchase them, we'll purchase them for them. And all of these items that they purchase are going to be listed on the, um, on the um, purchase order, which we're going to have for the client. And the other thing is we're going to have a contract which outlines everything that's incorporated within the project. I hope um, that's the first little video, and here comes the second little video. It shows a little bit uh, closer to the prices that uh, are going to cost for the, the uh, faucets. As you can see in the background, you can either have a, a long plate, or generally speaking, they can have a standalone where there is no plate the black. It's just a round piece that sits on top of your cupboards. And I'll just let you view these in a little bit more quiet atmosphere now. Chances are if the faucets are on sale, they're being discontinued. And that's very important to understand. The manufacturer has stopped making them. So you might have problems finding parts for them in the future. And that's it for the videos for right now. I Hopefully this little bit will help you... Um, 
understand that the the there's so many supplies that you can get for your bathrooms and kitchens these days and it's all going to depend on how much you want to spend and put into it a lot of people don't want to put too much into it or nothing at all but again it's going to be a baseline cost no matter what hopefully this will help you understand that these are only two stores and there's there's got to be at least 50 more and specialty stores that you can go to here in Edmonton alone. Or you can even get them over the internet. So just, re just a reminder for one very important thing is uh, warranties. Who do you want to be responsible for them, the contractor or yourself? And have fun searching because if you want the contractor to search for you, you're most likely going to be charging you for their time in the background. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Happy renovations.